Hey guys, it's Kristen with another chance resale. Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be opening two shopgoodwill.com jewelry lots that I won on auction. And one of them is here and I have the invoice and the other one is next to me still in the box. Um, the box they sent this one in was really large and it confused me when it showed up on my door. So I opened it just to see you know what it was um so it is the jewelry so we're gonna put that to the side for now as well um first i want to get into a couple pieces that didn't sell from my last video that i want to show again um and i'm going to be i don't think i'm going to be dropping the price on some of them um, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> so if you are interested in purchasing anything that you see in this video, you can email me at another chance resale one at gmail.com. My information's in the description box. Always. I accept PayPal payment is due upon receipt of the invoice. No exceptions, no holds. Um, you can, let me see, $5 is the free, is the shipping flat rate under one pound and over one pound or inter international goes by weight and your location. And make sure you give me a screenshot or an item description um, and timestamp so I know what piece uh, you're talking about. And make sure you check that sold list that's pinned in the comments before you email me. It just helps with the amount of emails I get and trying to stay um, organized and return emails in a timely fashion. Okay, so we have the Kate Spade here. This one, I'm really shocked it didn't sell. This is really pretty. It's marked Kate Spade. It has the beautiful bezel set, yellow crystals. It goes with pretty much anything. It is beautiful and in excellent condition. And the there is an extender. It's on the smallest or shortest length and it's at 15 and a half wearable inches. And I'm going to have to stay at 15 for this one because it is Kate Spade. And I mean, I can sell this on eBay for probably around 30, 30, you know, 30 or so, $35. So even as a reseller, you can still purchase this and make double your money. But that is the one piece. This swank, um, really cool lion head silver tone necklace is still available. Oh, I didn't even realize he has crystal eyes. Oh, you guys. All right, if this doesn't sell in this video, I think I'm gonna keep this one because this is just too cool. The wearable length is 15 inches, and even if you have a jewelry collection, this is gonna make a really nice piece. So um, this I'm gonna keep at 15 as well because it's just super cool and unique, and I, I think it's well worth it. We also had the Diane von Furstenberg necklace, which is right here, her logo there. And it's silver tone, like a um, loose braided rope necklace, and it comes undone here. Really nice, really nice condition. Again, same with the Swank. It's a 16 and a half inch wearable length. And um, I don't remember what I did on this in the last video, but I'll do 15 in this video. And if it doesn't sell, it's gonna go on my eBay for probably around 30. So there's that. Um, then we also had, I know this isn't really jewelry, but I think it's really cool. Um, it's the Chico's um, keychain with the suede tassel, the faux cinnabar, um, the Chinese character, the Buddha. So I just thought it was really cool, and I think I think this was like six or eight dollars. I'll do five on it this time. I just think it's pretty cool. And then of course we had the um, ring, the silver sterling silver diamond and chrysophrase. We thought maybe peridot. Um, I had a lot of people say this and the earrings were peridot. Um, Probably, you know, the gem tester is not accurate and obviously there's other stones that categorize under the um, ones that are listed on the gem tester. So I was just kind of experimenting with you guys and I appreciate you all being so kind. Well, at least most of you were so kind. <laughs> uh, 
Um, so, you know, I'm learning still and I appreciate everyone's help, but this one's still available. It did test as diamonds, the four stones around the center green stone. And um, let's see what size this was. It's an eight and I, I think I was up between 80 or 90 on this one. I'll go to 75, but that's the lowest. Other than that, I'm listing it on eBay after this. So that's that ring. And now let's time. it's time to get into the shopgoodwill.com lots. So if you are interested, you can email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. And um, check that sold list in the comment section before emailing. Um, if you haven't bought from me before, you can email me with your PayPal email address and mailing address uh, along with the items that you would like. So I spent about $55 on this lot. Now, if you guys are not Chico's fans, I'm sorry, but this, this lot is all Chico's. So I may not get very many views on this video, but hey, it is what it is. So let's see what they sent me regarding Chico's. I know for me, Chico's sells very well, um, especially on eBay. So we will see what kind of goodies Chico's has in here. I just like how their stuff is so bold and bright and beautiful. It, they really are like classy you know, statement pieces without being like gaudy. So here is the first pair that's new on card. It was marked down to $10.99 and they are blue dyed mother of pearl shells and some maybe wood green beads. So let's do $6 on these. And not that I wanna say it, but Christmas is coming. <laughs> so anything that you see in my videos that are like new on card like this, they make a great gift. So keep that in mind. And I'm also going to be shouting out a uh, creator for my creator showcase, a YouTube creator. And um, her, her name is Marilyn and she has a husband Barry that also goes on with her and their YouTube channel is called Shady NY and I will put the information on the screen and also link their channel in my description box. They do unboxings and jewelry and sales, you know, so definitely give them a little check and subscribe and um while you're if you didn't subscribe to me yet that button is right there and any any person that you subscribe to you can make sure you click that bell to all so you're notified when they make new videos all right so let's go with this chico's this one's really pretty this is a gold tone hammered bezel set yellow stone necklace this is very cool it has an extender, so you can definitely double it. And let's get the total uh, wearable length at the shortest is 18 inches. I really like this one. It's in good condition. So let's do um, 10 on that. Here's another pair of earrings, new on the card. Silver tone with some greens and pinks. $16.95, so um, let's do six again on these. Nice, um, you know, muted colors, pastels and whatnot. This one too. So this is a double strand necklace. I really like the colors on this. This would look great with a pair of jeans and like a white tank top or t-shirt uh, or even a black top, really cute. Just cute to dress up a pair of jeans. And we do have an extender. Let's measure the shortest length. So this is definitely a collar necklace and it can go a little longer. It's measuring seven and a half inches to the first um, layer. 
Really excellent condition. Let's do eight on it. Ooh, this one's new with tag also. Chico's. So this was marked down to $49.99. And let's see what it looks like. All right, I think we have a bit of a tangle going on here. And some hair, ew. Ew. All right, let me get this out. There we go. Yeah, this is like almost braided. It got so tangled. Eek, what happened? What happened here? I don't know why it's like this. Come on, you can do it. There we go, all right. So it's um, multi-strand, let's see, there's like, there's eight strands it looks like, gold tone, and then it comes down to all these circular, um, whatever you wanna call them here, <laughs> a pave ball, and then some tassels. Really cute. None missing. New with tag. The shortest length is 16 inches wearable and you can make it longer. So let's do 12 on this since it has the tag. Ooh, this one looks cool. I like how this um, Shop Goodwill seller individually bagged everything. Let's see where it came from. Belmar, New Jersey. Yeah, I feel like any jewelry from New Jersey um, is bagged very nicely. Okay, this is really cool. This is like an enamel flower, really pretty colors. Chico's to the back. Um, faux leather cords. Silver tone here. And let's get a wearable length. At the shortest, it would definitely be a collar necklace at seven inches wearable, and then you have this really long extender. So let's do seven on it. That one's cool. Okay, this one, I see some discoloration, but let's just take a look. Yeah, now I don't see it anymore. Might have just been on the back. But this is another Chico's and it's gold tone, like a um, matte gold tone with this taupe color, grayish braided cord. Um, let's get a measurement. I'll do it on the shortest. But this can definitely be doubled and it's about a 16 inch wearable length. We can do, we can just do five on this one. Ooh, this one looks nice. Gold tone with these really pretty like lemon colored stones. They are plastic. I'm trying to get it situated here. We have another little tangle. It gets like intertwined with each other. There we go. So you have these lemony color bezel set matte stones and then it comes down to one and then a tassel. Really nice, nice condition. It does have an extender. The shortest length is 17 inch wearable. And let's do 10 on it. Nice summer necklace. Okay, so it looks like we have some more new with card. This is cool. I like the new with card stuff. 
it makes an easier sale to list and, and to list on eBay. People love to get new with tag stuff at a discount, especially for gifts. Um, they search for those actually in the search, you know, in the um, search options, I guess you can say on eBay, new with tags. So this one originally sold for $45. We have, what's this, like a magnetic? Yeah, magnetic closure, little charm bracelet. Really cool, this one's awesome. So got a lot going on here. Golds and silvers, faux pearls, and it's a seven and a half inch wearable length. I should say total length. And let's do 10 on it since it has the tags. And then we have these cuties, new on card. Wow, look at those. I like those. So this is like a, um, like a very light peach. I think the stone itself is clear and it just has this design underneath and so it makes it look like the stone is peachy colored. Really, really pretty. So let's do um, eight on these since they're new on the card. Ooh, this is cool. What, what, what? <laughs> This is awesome. So this is gold tone. It does have an extender. It is long. It has these leather metallic cords. All this asymmetrical cool stuff. This is probably real stone. It's It could possibly be sodalite. And these all feel like plastic. But this is the coolest part. This acrylic horn. Very, very cool. Um, you know what? I think I might pull this one for my mystery jewelry monthly subscription box. It is really unique and cool and I love it and it's in excellent condition. So sometimes I like to just show you guys what I pull from um, my lots. I do buy things specifically for my mystery jewelry subscription boxes, but sometimes I like to give you guys an idea of what can be in them. So I will be pulling that one. And if you are interested in signing up for the jewelry subscription box, there you can sign up anytime because I send out the box as soon as you sign, sign up. And then you get um, a box every month going forward. You can cancel and rejoin anytime. So there's no like um, pressure or you know anything to stay on. So I'll put that link in the description box for you guys to check out if you're interested. And if you are interested in purchasing anything in the video, you can email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. Make sure you're putting this screenshot and or timestamp and description of the items that you're interested in in the email. I accept PayPal and payments due immediately. And check that sold list pinned in the comments. Woo woo! Okay, so this one's really cool. This is silver tone. We got a lot going on. We got some uh, pro probably more sodalite, maybe. We got some glass beads. We have this really cool orange bead. We have silver tone. Really cool. All these different color strands. Wearable length that's on the longest at 8 inches. Definitely a really cool collar necklace. So we're going to do... Um, eight dollars on this one. Here's another new on card. <clears throat> These are cutesy little earrings. They're marked down to eight ninety nine. They feel like just plastic, but they're gold tone with like a reddish and black stone, or I should say bead. We'll do five on those ones. Ooh, here's a cool bracelet. Gold tone with these. These are all plastic. Uh, green and like a peachy beige. Really nice condition. I'll give you a measurement and we're coming in at seven and a half inches. Let's do six on this one. 
Here's another pair of earrings. Silver tone little medallion style earrings. Um, hmm. Are we missing stones out of them? No. It's kind of weird because there's three stones. Top, top, bottom, and side. Top, bottom, side. But wouldn't you think there'd be one here or no? <laughs> I don't know. I think so because the other holes you can see through. These ones you can't. So I think we're missing a stone on each. So I'll put these into craft for $1. All right, so we have some mixed metals going on here. We have some coppers and golds and silvers. Let's get it straight here. So it's triple strand. Each strand is a different metal. This is cool. This is very industrial. Um, what's that other word I'm looking for? Uh, brain fart. But anyway, uh, if you know what I'm talking about, put it in the, in the comments. It's like industrial. It's like a uh, decor style. Um, yeah, I can't think of it. Anyway, this is really cool. We have your coppers, golds, and silvers. And it has an extender. Let's get it. It's on the loose, I mean the tightest, which is probably going to be a collar style which is seven and a half inches and can go longer. It does have a little bit of weight on this one, so uh, let's do eight bucks. Steampunk, that's what I was looking for, steampunk. <laughs> okay, so here is another one. This is Silver Tone. Wait, which way does it go? Here we go. So this is cute. It has all these little triangles and dangling from each one is a faux pearl and a rhinestone. Very cute. This would look great jazzing up some jeans as a collar necklace. So let's see. Shortest length measures eight inches and can go longer. Let's do six on that one. Ooh, another one new with tag. $32.95 retail. This one's cool. It's all plastic beads. Look at that one though. It has like a furry cheetah bead inside. Ha! <laughs> Very cool. So they're all plastic, but they're all very nice. Wearable length is 17 inches. It can go longer with the extender. And I mean, it could probably be doubled if you want. Really nice. Let's do 12 on it since it has the tag. Ooh, this is interesting. So this is silver tone, a long rope chain, and then look at this cool pendant. Very um, modernist. Really cool. There's a teensy bit of wear to the pendant, but not too bad. This is wood. Very cool. Let's get a measurement. Wearable length is 16 inches. There is no extender but you can probably double it since it has a clasp and make this like higher up on your chest. So let's do um, eight on that. Here's another one new with tag, $39 retail, gold tone, it is long. This is cute. So we have a star, we have a heart, we have a little bug, another little bug, <laughs> all these cute little plastic stones. 
you can definitely double it. There is an extender as well. And it's measuring 15 and a half wearable length. So let's do 12 since we have the tag on it. Ooh, these earrings look cool. These are like a red, like cracked enamel, if that makes sense. <laughs> Like a brick red, really cool. We'll do five. Okay, this one's gold tone. All these are in really good condition. That's really good. Really, really good. <laughs> so this one, it's in good condition, but there's a little scratch there, but none on this side. So I would wear this to the front. Really cool pendant. There is an extender, but right now it's at the longest, sitting at 10 and a half inches, wearable length, so it can go shorter. Let's do eight. Ooh, these are cool. Look at these. Okay, so here's the front. These look like they need to just be cleaned a little bit. But very cool cheetah print. They almost look like they're furry underneath, like it's calf hair. And these are wood. I thought maybe you can, re uh, you know, reverse the reversible, but you can't. There's no way to switch them. But anyway, very cool. We'll do $6 on those. Come on, why don't you wanna come out? There we go. These are cute, I love the colors on these. Bluish green down here, and you have almost like a purple blue. And we'll just say purple. And they're marked to the back, really pretty. We'll do five on those. Cool. These look, these are giving me like modern mod vibes, gold tone and silver tone with some green. We'll do five on those. We have a bunch of earrings coming up. Okay, let's see what these are. These are little tassel earrings. There's uh, gold tone, silver tone, and copper. Really nice, little dangles. We'll do four. These are clip-on, silver tone, hammered, and antiqued a little bit. We'll do four. These don't have backs, so if anybody purchases them, I will include backs. Oh, actually, these are not in good condition. We're going to pass on those, actually. These are really cute. Again, they don't have backs, but I will put them on if you purchase. They're like a brass tone earring. We'll do four. And these are also not in good condition. I'm not even gonna take them out of the bag. They are just, nope, we're gonna pass on those. <laughs> All right, so this is the last of the bag and then we'll go into the other Shop Goodwill lot. Wow, this looks big. Let's see. Let's see if I can get this without it being a tangled mess. <laughs> Where's the other end? Okay, got it. Got it. This is definitely multi-strand. This looks like an eight strand. And it's also layered. So 
Some of them feel like real stone, like these. And some are plastic. These might be quartz. Pink quartz. We have some of these. Those are cool beads. These are all, these all feel real. They're cold to the touch. Wow, a lot going on here. These feel real. So let me know what you guys think, what kind of stone you think these pink ones are. Wow, really cool. So a wearable length, I'm gonna do a total length. It's approximately 26 inches total. There's even some mother of pearl in there. We're gonna do um, 15 on this one. That's really cool. Here's a silver tone necklace with an extender. It's very long and it has these different stations, asymmetrical design, good condition. It's on the shortest length, measuring 18 inches, wearable. We'll do eight on that. Here's a bracelet, some other pearl shell pieces and little uh, faceted stones and silver tone. It is magnetic. Really pretty. Good condition. Eight inch wearable length. Let's do eight on it. Black seed beads with all these really cool bright colors, silver tone as well. It does have an extender. Shortest length, we're looking at seven inches and it can go larger. So let's do seven on it. These are clip-ons, little button earrings, so cute. I love the sides. Silver tone hammered, we'll do four. Here's another, is this a bracelet? No, this is just a necklace. Ooh, this is actually cool. This is a nice little collar necklace. It's got two chains on it. Shortest length. It's gonna be about seven and a half inches wearable and can go longer. We'll do five. That can go with anything. Oh, here's another pair of those earrings, but yeah, they look a little bit better, but they're still, they still look so worn. I don't know, I'm just gonna do a dollar on these two. I don't really feel comfortable selling them as wearable. <clears throat> okay, so we have silver tone and some blue beads. Let's see what happened here. What happened? Okay, there we go. So it's a double strand, really long silver tone necklace, but it's got these really pretty blue crystals and they are they all do feel like glass really pretty it does have an extender so you can probably double this and it's a 15 inch wearable length to the shortest extension so let's do eight on that <clears throat> Ooh, we have like a juicy couture look right here so this is Chico's, this is, well obviously, this is a chunky curb chain silver tone bracelet with a big chunky puffy heart and um, different lengths. Definitely reminds me of Juicy Couture. So we have a measurement of nine inches, eight inches, or seven inches. And it does have some nice weight to it. 
we are going to do um, $10. All right, we have a few more pieces. Actually, no, we just have one, just this one right here. These are like the other ones, the other red ones, but these are more of like a bronze. We'll do, I don't remember what I did on the other ones. We'll do four on these. All right, now let's get into the other lot. I do not know what it is. I did win a bunch of lots lately off of shopgoodwill.com, so they're all making their way to me. Okay, so this is two lots in one. This is J. Crew and Designers Fashion Jewelry Lot. Approximately $52. Remember, you guys can email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com. Make sure you're checking that sold list pinned in the comments. All right, why can't I cut through this? There we go. We can just pull it out. Okay, two little lots. Let's see. Close my box cutter so nobody gets hurt. Wee. Okay, first up we have a Chico's watch that is, of course, not working. I don't think any of them ever are. They still have the back plastic on it, which is cool. It looks like it's in really nice condition. I will change the battery and see if I can get it working and put some information on the screen for you. Ooh, Kate Spade. This, of course, is not working either. You know what? Let's do the circumference now. Seven inches. And I will get some information on the screen about this one, too. There is a little bit of wear, but overall, it's in really nice condition. All right, let's look at this. This is definitely Chico's. I love this. This is giving me Asian vibes with the medallion and the red and the black rope cord. There is an extender, but right now at the smallest, it's sitting at 14 inch wearable length. Let's do 10 on this one. That's really nice. I like that. Here is a J. Crew blue and like an AB cloudy with a gold tone. Really nice. Let's do a wearable length of eight and a half inches, and we'll do ten on this one. This has a tag. It is White House Black Market. Um, I think some are plastic and some are glass. We have the tightest length. There is an extender at six and a half inches wearable. So let's do um, eight on this one. It's really nice, really pretty. Ooh, a J. Crew bracelet. Okay, that's not stretchy. Gold tone with the clear stones. Nice condition. We have a couple of different size extensions. It could be eight inch, seven, or six and a half. Look at that. Ooh, I like this. That is glitz. Glitz and glam right there. So let's do eight on this one. 
We have another J. Crew. This has like a very light pale green, I would say, with some AB crystals. I think they're all here. On a gold tone uh, chain, it's on the shortest. There is a little bit of wear up toward the clasp. It's an eight inch wearable length. And let's do eight on this one. This is J. Crew as well. I like this, the bezel set, light brown. It almost looks purple, but the cord is definitely brown, the ribbon. So the cool thing about the ribbon is you can tie it at any length that you would like. I would love this as a collar necklace but the longest you can have it is 18 and a half inches. And let's do eight on it. Here's another J. Crew. This one definitely has a lot more wear to the chain. Um, I mean, it's not in, it's not the worst condition, but I'm just gonna do $3 on it. It's still okay, like these. this is still okay, but the chain definitely has a lot of wear. So we'll just do three on that. Here's another J. Crew necklace. Actually, this one's not marked, but it looks like it would be J. Crew, but I guess I can't say it is if it's not marked. <laughs> so it's gold tone with the clear crystals. And wearable length is seven and a half inches. We'll do five on it. Then we have this. This is Coldwater Creek. There's a little bit of wear to the clasp. And then you have all these really pretty beads. These are glass. Are they? Maybe not. Plastic. Browns and greens. It's supposed to emulate, um, not margasite. Oh, malachite. I'm having brain farts today, guys. So it is long, but because of the clasp, you can definitely double it. And it's a 17 inch wearable length. Let's do five. And then we look, it looks like we have two pairs of earrings. Then we're going to go into the second lot. So these are Chico's. Wow. Look at that. How pretty are these? So let's do six on these, really nice condition, Chico's. And then we have these J. Crew, pretty uh, muted like green and uh, kind of like a peachy color, gold tone. We'll do five on those. All right, let's see what's in the last bag. Make sure you guys check that sold list before emailing. And I accept PayPal. Payments due immediate upon receipt of the invoice. All my information is always in the description box. And let's keep going. Ay ay ay, this might be a little bit of a mess. All right, first we have a J. Crew bangle. It's like a cuff, but it's really not in good condition. So we're going to skip on this one and put that into the craft lot for $1. This is like the infamous J. Crew style necklace. It got oversaturated in the market. Um, it's still really pretty. It's in okay condition. The chain has got some issues, but this looks okay. So wearable length is nine, nine inches, but since this chain is so like chunky, you can really put the clasp at any, of, at any of those. So we'll do five on this because I know it's not really the most in style anymore, but it is still very pretty. Oh wow, this is all one necklace. 
All right. <laughs> Hold on. We got some tangles. There we go. This is Chico's. Wow, this is a big mama. So let's see, we have a really long extender. A lot of different layers going on here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine layers. I'm not gonna describe each layer. You guys can just take a look at it. They're all plastic, all different color metals. It is at the tightest, shortest length to the first layer is seven inches and then it can go longer. So let's do 10 on this one. Here is a three layer necklace, silver tone, but it's got these really cool like open discs, silver tone and gold tone. Really nice, it does have an extender. It's on the tightest right now, which to the first layer is eight inches and can go longer. Let's do eight on that one. All right, and this is the last of it, so let's see. I did see these in the picture. These are all Skagen, which they do all right online. Um, of course, none of them are working, so I will look into replacing all of the batteries and seeing if I can get them working. And I'll let you know on the screen. The first one is eight and a quarter inches. This one is almost nine inches, eight and a half, and eight and a half. All right. So I'll get the information on the screen for you guys. We have another J Crew. What happened? What happened to you? Okay, here it goes. This one's cute. Blues and some like cloudy ABs. Oh no, we're missing a lot of stones on this one. Nope. That one's going into the craft lot. Chico's, new a tag, $89. Let's finish with a bang. Look at this. Look at this beauty. Wow. Excellent, perfect, new condition. Silver tone bib. Now, if you, here, this is the front. Now, if you need a definition of a bib necklace, here it is. <laughs> So this is awesome. This is gladiator style. This is 100% statement uh, bib necklace. Really pretty. So let's do um, 14 on this one. And we have an extender. I would wear this a little lower than my collar so that it like covers my whole chest plate. That'd be so cool. Um, we're looking at about nine inches wearable to the small, the shortest extension. So cool. I mean, look how big that is. All right, guys, that wraps up this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Click that thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed. I appreciate each and every one of you, and we will see you in the next one.